This show has been getting a lot of X-Files comparisons. Would mm -hmm. someone like to say why that is? Well, first off, because I think they're fair. I mean, uh, it's on Fox, and it's a science fiction show-ish, and it is a they are self-contained storylines, so there's a lot of similarities, but we don't deal so much in the paranormal world that they did. So it's a good it's a good entree and an easy way to describe our show to people, but it's a lot. It is very much its own thing. Mm. Okay. In, in it, you two are father and son. Yeah. Yes, I'm his son. I can see it. I can too. Yeah. <laughs> I'm holding up pretty well, I think. And we very well. We're both left-handers. Do you know that? I didn't know you were. Yeah. No. I can't show off my left hand now because it's been signed by Anna Torres. Oh, is that right? Times. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. He just can't take and her anywhere. The bus. Uh, what no. did you do to him? She marked me. Just just marked her. Him. Yeah. Um. He really marked me. <laughs> that was just a little. This is art, fight. okay? <laughs> this is just random squiggles. <laughs> Not Explain really. your relationship then. Um, uh, it's sort of a relationship by n necessity. Walter's sort of the pin. I need Walter. I can't deal with Walter without Peter. Excellent. Really. So you get through. I'm a hanger on. Basically. I know. Hanger on. Yeah. I <laughs> ask you. I'd she couldn't get Walter out of the mental institute. Right. <laughs> you are Ow. schizophrenic. Was I? Amongst other things. <laughs> you think so? <laughs> <laughs> Golly. <laughs> Uh, she couldn't get him out of the... Oh, I keep sliding down this chair. What is this? Without, uh, well, it is without a bit of my a son who's my trick couch. couldn't be released without the ne like next, next of kin. Okay. So I fly all over the world to find Peter Bishop and threaten him if he doesn't come and help me get... He'll be exposed. ...his father. Well, if he doesn't come and help me get in to see his father, and mm. then when we get there, Walter pulls the little rabbit doors. out of the hat and says, well, actually, I want to get out. So What does... Fringe. What's the significance of fringe? It deals with um, science and conspiracy, and not phenomena so much as incidents that are on the fringe, really, of is the term society. Used, yeah, and is it, the term fringe science was used for a lot of work that was done, particularly in the eighties and seventies and eighties, which was outside stuff, quite secret, and and a lot of it done for defence purposes, and so that's kind of where we come into it. Okay. And I've heard JJ say many times now that he looks back at Alias and is like, I have no idea what that was even about. <laughs> so he's trying to keep things maybe a little more linear and episodic on this one. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, absolutely. But without losing that whole overarching storyline, there's still, um, there's still. Oh sure. Right. Yeah. Well, the fun, you know, the fun of science fiction, which is that you dip into this world that has its own self-supporting mythology, and then all the characters on the inside are sort of part of that world. And so long as we create that world believably, then we can do anything inside of it. Mm -hmm. And that's he did that. A Bitten Alias, which is kind of our world, but with Jennifer Garner being a super hot spy, and the same on Lost, which is kind of our world, but then there's this completely other mythology that goes with it. I think our show will be similar, that it'll have this grand overarching mythology, but different in that each episode, or most episodes, not probably all of them, but most episodes will have a, a sort of self-contained beginning, middle, and end, and then tied into all of that will be a little sort of hint or a insinuation mm. about what the grander story is. Your panel seemed to go okay today. Yeah, the, I, I, here's the other thing I was told about Comic-Con. Because it's like really adept fans, people who really, really parse this stuff out on, a sort of, on all the minutia, I'd always been told that you really have to be on your game, which I, for one, after 37 hours of being awake, am not. Um, but they were actually really uh, kind. It's very calm. Too, yeah, wasn't and it? they're fascinated with JJ. They're fascinated yeah. with him. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, the bulk of the questions went his way. He's become quite the god to them. Yeah, I think, at this yeah point. exactly. It's yeah. like him and Kevin Smith. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Figurehead. There's yeah. going to be a comic book where they have a fight, and that'll be the that'll be the grand moment for Comic Con. <laughs> All right, best JJ uh, Smith Royale. Sorry. <laughs>